Andy Perkliver18 here today with another Series 21 LEGO minifigure unboxing. As you would have seen from my last episode, I opened up four LEGO Series 21 minifigures. I got three different ones and one duplicate, which makes sense if I got four. Pretty happy with the selection I got. I haven't felt these ones again because of the Chima virus. I got them at the exact same time from the same LEGO store, from the same box I'm assuming. So I have no idea what these four minifigures will be. And I don't want to waste any more time. Let's just get right into it and start praying that there are no more duplicates. Alright, so let's take a look at the first minifigure here. It already feels a little bit different than any of the ones that I opened up last time. Uh, but literally, time will only tell because you can have no idea and I've never felt these minifigures before. Well, ooh, I was correct. This one is different and it's one of the best ones in this series, I would have to say. Set the packaging off to the side and I'll bring back over my list. Uh, this one is the beekeeper and I do I honestly mean it when I say I think this one is definitely one of the best ones in this series um, Let's take a look. Wow. I'm gonna build this up really quick and then I'll show you All right, so this is the beekeeper minifigure here as you can see definitely one of the most epic figures of the series Comes on the base plate here with the full white gown as well as the hair and the hat piece Which is all one big piece to keep him nice nice safe and protected he's got his colony of bees right there which i just think is a really cool printed piece and then of course the canister that they spray them with which is actually a mug upside down which i've never seen lego do and then this newer piece that we saw in series 21 uh and series 20 just to make it up but no this is definitely one of the coolest minifigures out there in this series it's definitely in line with the ladybug so this is awesome again this is one i i wouldn't mind getting a few duplicates of because it's really cool all right so i'll set him back to the side there mark him off on my minifigure sheet now of eight minifigures collected, four down, four down, and five have been opened. I probably just jinxed myself. I don't know why I said that. Might edit that out, hopefully. But uh, let's take a look at the second minifigure. Oh, you know what? I kind of jinxed myself, but I'm not upset about it. As you can see, this one here is another beekeeper. Again, I'm going to put him right back in it. Probably won't even list this one right in my Brickling store because I just said two seconds ago I wouldn't mind getting duplicates of him. I'm probably just going to seal this guy back up and put it in my storage bin and hide it away for the next year or so. But I am excited to get another beekeeper. So that is, out of six minifigures I've opened, two duplicates so far. But at least one of them has been a really good duplicate. So I'll set this guy off to the side so I don't lose any of the pieces here. And let's take a look at the third minifigure from this video and this uh i have no idea what it is it doesn't i guess it doesn't really feel like one of the ones i've already opened so that's a good sign well this is another really good one all right i am doing well in the second video way better than part one but as you can see this one here is the dog this looks incredible it's got the new bone piece which is in a different color than the standard white one it's got the short legs but they're the short opposable and like posable legs so i'm really happy with that this is what the torso looks like cool printing on both sides and then of course what you really want to see is the head looks really really great you can still see the minifigure through it very very happy uh, with how this minifigure looks it looks really cute so awesome cannot complain about that minifigure there as well this has been a really great video so far i hope i'm not jinxing it again uh, marking number minifigure number five off on my list here And let's get into it with the fourth and final figure. This is actually, I only bought eight so far, and that's why I broke it into two videos. So when next time I buy a few more, next time I go to the Lego store, I'll probably be making a second, you know, a third part. And in this one, ooh, this one is one that's kind of cool, but not one that I'm super thrilled about getting to duplicate of. Uh, this one here is the Space Police. So this one might go along with the, uh, the Space Guy, and I'll list him on my Brooklyn store it's not a bad figure definitely not a bad figure just not obviously one of my absolute favorite ones but I can't complain I did get a few duplicates in this video but this is a good one this is a cool figure like I said in part one if you can remember and then of course the beekeeper is amazing I said right at the start of this video I wouldn't mind getting another one of that so from this video opening up four Lego minifigures as you can see I did manage to get two different ones and I'm not even really mad about the duplicates because they're pretty cool definitely check out the space police guy in my Bricklink store it'll be on sale by the time you're watching this video uh, but of course I'm gonna hold on to the extra beekeeper for now because I think that would just be a really cool one to have but anyway thanks so much for watching this video if you did enjoy please don't forget to leave a like comment and of course subscribe 
I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next video, and hopefully I'll get some more of these Series 21 LEGO minifigures soon to open up for you. Thanks again for watching, and have a great day.